What's up, everybody? Destin Legary here, taking you through Crisis 3. Um, we're going to start out on the hardest difficulty, and I am just going to see if I can get through it. The reason we are playing on the Xbox 360 and not the PC is because the Xbox 360 has achievements, and I like achievements. I am an achievement whore, as some people would call it. So uh, let's hop in and choose storage device. We will do that. Uh, we'll do cloud save games. We need to be online. Okay, so we'll do the hard drive. Turn the brightness a little bit. Just our horizontal. Just our vertical. Exciting stuff. We're going to go right into the campaign. New campaign. We're going to do it on Super Soldier. Because that's how we roll. And yes, we will do the tutorial. Because there's an achievement with it. Not because I don't know what I'm doing. Definitely not for that reason. Because obviously, you know, it's Christ 3. I've got this. I'm going to be just fine. I hope. Hold X to enter game. Trust me, just fine. I'm going to be okay. We got this. All right. Welcome to the nanosuit training simulation environment. Training is divided into several subsections. Each subsection can be accessed individually. Here you will learn navigational control of your nanosuit. We call the nanosuit Battle Armor Perfected, but it's much more than that. The navigation panel gives you real-time tactical feedback on your surroundings. Now make your way through the assault course. Okay. Artificial muscles assist interaction with your environment. You can jump higher. You can climb further. Pretty easy so far. Pretty easy stuff. Press forward. Follow the directions. Here you will learn how to handle weapons with your nano suit. I was going to hit fire. Oh, maybe not. Whoa, what? So I've been playing a lot of Crisis on PC. This feels quite slow in comparison, but I'll get used to it. Use your weapon sights. High definition, very focal eye lenses give you unmatched accuracy. Target snap auto corrects on zoom. Cycle through nearby targets for maximum combat efficiency. Even with fast twitch recoil compensation, rapid fire is inaccurate. Use semi-auto to improve kill ratios. Oh, oops. Weapon ah, boy. Not doing so good. On the fly attachment swap out. To adjust to changing battlefield conditions. Doesn't matter, I get how to use the gun. Attachments are automatically added to your inventory and are always available. Mount the scope to engage distant targets. Come on, really? Accelerated reflexes make switching to your secondary faster than a reload. No Call of Duty lock on, that's interesting. Come on. This is embarrassing. I apologize for how poorly I'm doing. Your visor will alert you uh, to initial restock locations. 
I assure you, my actual gameplay will be much better than this. You get at it. Telemetry integration allows active target aiming assistance. Booyah. The nanosuit offers only partial protection from withheld grenades. Throw them within four seconds. This tutorial is complete. Continued free practice is supported by this module. Yeah, I'm good with not doing the tutorial anymore. Here you will learn the fundamentals of nanosuit combat operations. All nanosuit functions require energy. Some functions drain energy faster than others. Energy is recovered automatically from multiple sources within the environment. Got it, let's go. Stand by for nanosuit function training. Okay, move forward. Armor mode deflects incoming fire. The more damage deflected, the greater the energy consumption. Cloak refracts light around the nanosuit, making it practically invisible. The faster the movement, the more energy is required. I'm invisible, you can't see me. Combine nanosuit modes dynamically What's up? to maintain combat advantage over your enemies. The nanosuit monitors cortisol stress hormones in nearby enemies to calculate observability. The threat level is communicated to you via your HUD stealth. Oh, he's dead. He is definitely gonna die. Come here. Cloak mode provides silent kill opportunities. Here we will cover advanced elements of nanosuit combat operations. I'm just going to pause here a second. And uh, check one of my settings. Make sure my notifications are turned on. Ah, see? It's a good thing I checked. The tactical visor analyzes the battlefield topography, marking targets and points of interest. Computer system exploitation or hacking is another function of the tactical visor. Try that again. Failed system exploitations will temporarily disable your nanosuit functions. Yeah, I just found that out. Nanovision is a function of the tactical visor which provides full spectrum acuity. This gives enemies no place to hide, even in pitch black environments. Nanovision is a highly advanced feature and consumes energy while active. The nanosuit strength augmentation allows rapid destruction of soft cover and power lifting of oversized objects. Kick oversized objects to clear paths and kill enemies. <laughs> Take that, random guy. Welcome to the tutorial sandbox. Here you can test out your nano suit abilities in complete safety. Combine nano suit modes dynamically to maintain combat advantage over your enemies. All right, well we got this thing sharp achievement. Let's finish this up.
Hi. Well, that was pretty easy. We call the nano suit battle armor perfected. With this tutorial, we aim to perfect the soldier. Good luck out there. Twenty-three years ago, the alien Seth invaded our world. We stopped them. I stopped them. But the Cell Corporation seized the opportunity, stepping into the power vacuum, quickly growing in size and influence to the brink of world domination. Cell took us all by surprise. Even me. They call me Prophet. And I'm the only one who knows what's coming. Cell are not the real threat to our world. The most powerful alien, the Alpha Seth, still lives. He showed me a glimpse of the future. He knows what drives me, what I believe. That being a good soldier comes down to one thing, to one single question. What are you prepared to sacrifice? Remember me. When they came to me with the nano suit, I sacrificed Lawrence Barnes, the man I was, to become prophet. When my own flesh and blood held me back, I sacrificed that too. Replaced it like a spare part. Victory costs. Every time you pay a little more. I saw a glimpse of what's coming. And there was nothing left of me to stop it. fails, what do we do then? What do I do?
Easy, friendlies. You remember friendlies. Psycho. Where's your nano suit? Cell skinned me. Skinned us all. You're the last one. It's all about that suit now. Okay, so it looks like that is it for the tutorial mission of Crisis 3. We're going to hop into the first mission now. And for more on Crisis 3, be sure to keep it locked right here on IGN. Yeah. <laughs>